Well, of course, we celebrate women every day here, but March 8th is International Women's Day, recognizing the accomplishments of women. And joining us now with a roundup of some pretty cool products from innovative female-led brands is style expert Allison Dayette. Allison, good morning. Good morning. I mean, it's like, go, girl. Yes, <laughs> we're taking on the world. <laughs> I love that. Go, girl. Okay, so you're going to get us started, and, you know, we've got to have the, the fancy fashion. So you're starting with exactly. Democracy Clothing. Yeah, so mm -hmm. Democracy Clothing is founded by Karen Lettier, and she started it based on the principle of curve equality, recognizing that women are of all shapes and sizes, but created equal. So they fuse together style, comfort, and technology. They are one of the first brands to push size inclusivity, and her all-female design team creates everything in the collection, from dresses to jeans to tops to shorts. I have on, which you really can't see me there, absolution collection from their jeans that help you find the absolutely great pair of jeans. Okay, and, so and there is of... nothing better than a great pair of jeans, and I'm so glad to see at least uh, some brands in the fashion industry moving towards inclusivity. It's so important. Exactly. Uh, next up, we have Bagalini, and that comes from entrepreneurial founders Dixie Powers and Ann Simmons, who were global travelers. And, well, they knew a thing about packing, so they leveraged all those insights from their travels in creating this Bagalini line, and it's all kinds of bags. But they want to make sure that women feel confident, organized, and can kind of take on what matters, no matter if it's a trip around the block or a trip around the globe. These bags are incredible. They have all the different slots and pockets and organizing compartments. It's incredible and they have all different styles, whether it's something small to head out on errands or if it really is like your next vacation or a major trip. And more of us starting to travel now as we are hopefully yes. emerging from this pandemic. So we've got the jeans, we've got the bags, we've bags. got to have the gems, the jewelry. We've got to have the jewelry. And this comes from CEO and founder Madeline Frazier. She created the first digital platform for customizable fine jewelry. She started it because she was frustrated. She wanted to help design her own engagement ring and she found the jewelry industry was so old fashioned. She comes from a tech background. She's like, I got a solution for that. I'm gonna create it. So Gemis.co gives you the opportunity to customize fine jewelry, choosing your stones, your metals. You can work alongside a Gemis gemologist or you can even try on before you buy. They are actually offering WGN viewers a 20% off code. Use WGN20 and you'll get 20% off your next order. But let's move from jewelry to what I'm going to be opening tonight. <laughs> and, and tonight? That is from, tonight. <laughs> that is from Simi Winery. Mm, they have 145 ears years. Up. Yeah, <laughs> they've got 145 years of experience and specifically family member uh, Isabel Simi took over the reins of Simi Winery and their world class uh, winemaking from Sonoma County at the age of 18. Wow. She led the brand for seven years, even kept them open during prohibition. And then when it was time to retire, she handed over the lead to the other female winemakers at simiwinery.com. Wow. You can find them in wine shops around Chicago. I'm a big fan of their Chardonnay and their Cabernet Sauvignon. So this is going to be open tonight okay. with my husband. I <laughs> can't wait to sample that. Moving right along, but, Planting Hope. Yeah, so Planting Hope is a Chicago-based company that actually uh, is a female-led company of four plant-based brands, specifically What's in my morning coffee right now is their Hope and Sesame, which is their first commercially available uh, sesame milk. It's nutritionally comparable to dairy milk. They've got six different flavors from original, vanilla, chocolate. I learned about them first from their barista blend, which you can find at amazon.com. Hope and Sesame, you can find at Mariano's in so Chicago. Wait, so what so does sesame milk taste like? So it has still that creamy texture. It's protein packed you can even we actually put this in our smoothies mm -hmm. and uh last weekend we made uh protein packed pancakes with them nice. uh it is actually right now in this coffee <laughs> don't mind it might do um but yeah so you can find so it's just a really good dairy alternative just like you would find other you know alternative dairy milks uh but it, i love that it comes in different flavors my godson's come over on sun for sunday brunch and 
they're fans of the chocolate, which mm -hmm. usually happens with the kids. And then from hopeandsesame.com, we're also gonna end with another bag company, but this one comes from founder Nikki Reed. She and her husband have four kids, so for when the they decided to the start, daddies. yeah. <laughs> so they decided, having gone through a lot of diapers, they <laughs> wanted to create parent-friendly diaper bags that are for today's parents, that are gender-neutral in design. Mm -hmm. So equally sleek and chic, whether it's dad picking up the bag to go out the door right. or mom. Uh, they've got the fanny pack, the mini bag, the big bag, and the add-on gainer, which is brilliant is they have this kind of what looks almost like a water bottle and it is a modern ergonomic vacuum <laughs> this is in my car because i'm sure like kids make messes to clean up the so messes? quickly like the cheerios on the floor of the car you can keep it in the big bag you could be kind of out and about and they spill something and that it just cleans it all up genius Allison, thank you so much for joining us, for sharing all thank those great you. products. And for more information, you can check out her website and follow her on Twitter.